Frustrated homeowners demand to know what city leaders are doing to make their neighborhoods safer. At the first of several town hall meetings, tonight it was Council District E, which includes New Orleans East and parts of the 9th Ward. WGNO's Anna McAllister heard the complaints at a church on Dauphine Street. Anna. Kurt, Susie, residents raised concerns about violence, trash pickup, and other issues here in District E. And earlier today, I spoke with a woman who was a victim of a crime earlier in the morning in New Orleans East, and she and the residents here told me they want to see action from city leaders. I just saw someone slam my car door and run. It was like three guys. Ashley Chris had her car for only six months before she says it was broken into and severely damaged early Monday morning by several teens. When I came outside, I saw that they broke the steering column to my car and they didn't touch anything else. I had money sitting there and they didn't even touch it. They wanted my car. Chris, a single mother of four young children, now has to figure out how she's going to get around and afford the repairs. It's devastating. I work hard for everything I have. I don't have any help with anything and it's just sad that we have to go through this in this area. Chris is one of dozens of residents in District E that's looking for solutions and a plan from city leaders. Monday night, Mayor Latoya Cantrell and Councilman Oliver Thomas addressed various issues in District E with crime and youth offenders a main topic of conversation. I know one of the things that beginning of the school year though is we're going to partner with some of the schools, start conflict resolution. Uh, programs, do some mentoring programs. Right now here in the summer, we have to begin to round up uh, uh, kids in a positive way. The meeting at times emotional as residents pleaded for solutions from Mayor Cantrell and Thomas. We need resources that's going to point these troubled youth to places where they can find themselves on the job train. Another hot topic at the meeting, garbage collection. An issue many residents say they've been dealing with for a year. We have identified um, a contractor. Um, we are in negotiations of the contract right now. We asked folks after the nearly two hour town hall if they thought it was productive and their answers varied. I was pleasantly surprised. <laughs> it was actually nice. And it was very informative. A lot of generalities, wallowing nostalgia, talking circles around problems without offering specifics or hard figures. So basically it was New Orleans politics par for the course. And Mayor Cantrell asked that anyone who had a question that wasn't answered to email her office. She says that her team is going to work on quickly getting those responses. Kurt, Susie. All right. Thank you, Anna. We'll wait and see what the next town hall meeting is like.